is going on guys john here for another food review and today we are checking out a place called zoe's kitchen now this is a uh kind of greek themed restaurant i've never seen it before they have a few locations i have a map right here uh so they're mostly along the southern east coast uh so relatively small nationwide um so i decided to check it out in a so really cool place inside they have a lot of cool decorations and things like that then on each table they have a bottle of greek dressing so here we have the turkey sandwich with a side of quinoa let me get you in here for a close-up here we have the sandwich looking pretty good no crappy iceberg lettuce definitely looks like some nice lettuce there nice toast on the bread and then the quinoa is looking really good that looks like some broccoli in there a little bit of tomato some celery so all in all, guys, everything looks pretty good. Let's try it out. All righty, let's eat. It is time to try out the Zoe's Kitchen Turkey Stack. Here we go. Mmm. Wow. Absolutely bursting with flavor. So according to the menu, this sandwich has sliced turkey breast, mozzarella cheese, feta spread lettuce sourdough and a rosemary oil so what i'm tasting is that rosemary oil and the feta cheese spread this makes it out of this world the feta cheese spread kind of takes the place of a mayonnaise where it adds a creaminess and it adds a nice moisture to it and then the saltiness from the feta cheese this is seriously a very unique sandwich Moving on to the quinoa. They definitely have some veggies going on in here. Here's a nice piece of broccoli. All right, so it's cold quinoa. I can't say I've ever had cold quinoa before. I guess this would be more of a quinoa salad. Not bad though, not bad. All right guys, so Zoe's Kitchen was absolutely fantastic. It was one of those instances where you can have a big, overwhelming, bland, overstuffed sandwich, or you can have a petite, smaller sandwich that is absolutely bursting with flavor. And that's the kind of sandwich you have from Zoe's. So $7.79 for the sandwich and comes with the side. The quinoa salad was all right. I'm not going to bash it just because it's not something that I don't like. That's like me rating a tomato. Of course, I'm going to give it a zero because I hate them. You know what I mean? So, I mean, it looked good. The broccoli was fine. I like quinoa. Just to have it cold in a salad like that just wasn't my cup of tea. So, overall, guys, the sandwich was crispy bread, delicious meat. The rosemary oil just made it kind of this toasty, oily, almost like a French baguette dipped in pesto. You know, that experience of this oily, crunchy bread? That's what was going on with that bread. And then add the feta spread. It was this creamy, savory, salty mayonnaise substitute, I'll call it. And it just made everything, you know, kind of come together fantastically. So overall, the sandwich by itself, 10 out of 10, hands down. For $7.79 with the quinoa, I'm going to give it a 9 just because it is a little expensive for how little food you're getting. But the food that you're getting is unbelievable it's it knocks it out of the park in the flavor department it is fantastic so just a little pricey for uh for a quick in and out joint like that i mean yes you can sit down it is beautiful inside but they do specialize in the takeout so overall guys nine out of ten for the turkey stack from zoe's kitchen definitely go check it out though they have a lot of different items and i'm sure a lot of them are just as good so thank you very much for watching this video guys i do appreciate it please give it a thumbs up if you liked it please subscribe to my channel if you have not already and until next time guys i'll see you later